Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another Will Cheese Fail sent in by you, the fans, to lifesglitchtv at gmail.com. Mr. Maximus Black. Yes. I mean, just choose whatever you want to do at this point. I'm going to let you run with this one. You've got probably several options up there. You just go for it. I didn't I didn't even have to say anything. I just did wide open. Leave that yeah. open to the to the fates. Mm -hmm. Down here in the bottom right, we've got the red Protoss wolf, and in the top left is the blue Zerg a Micro Jackson. Mm. Great name. I it's like that name. Amazing name. Solid name. Yes. Yeah. Another One of the PVZ. Yeah. And here we go. Yeah, I uh I always been my favorite matchup. I think this is the exact yeah, this is the same map I think we were on last game as well. Big thank you to everybody mm. that's been sending in replays to lifesaglitchtv at gmail.com. I know we've had a little uh downtime from uh from cast, but we had uh that patch that came and then uh yeah, Adam got a got a job and it's been th things have been uh <laughs> Kind of little all over the place, but we're we're getting back into our groove. We're getting back into our groove. We're here. We haven't forgot we, about we you. We have games to cast again. Yes, Mo we most, do. Those specifically, we literally had none after zero. the last batch. We had yeah. zero. Zero. So now we are we are looking healthier. We're we're able to get some more games to you, and so mm -hmm. we're we're back in action. Uh, and I'm ready to see what kind of action we're going to be getting well, out of these gents because I'm not seeing a lot of cheese. No, them. and and this was marked in as a, as a will cheese fail. So I don't know. I mean, this is a one base. I don't see another hatch around. I mean, he's like, is he just going to like one base Nidus? Like, I'm not sure. He's got double gas. So, I mean, he's, he's up. There it is. There's the layer. I think it's going to be a one base Nidus all in. Protoss at this point has got to got to know that there's either a proxy hatch or it is going to be a Nidus play. They, they, because when you mm. don't see a third here, or sorry, a natural there or an expansion there, I mean, you know, there is a gold. I'd be immediately checking the gold to see. But if not, you're going to be you're, you're getting all in. And the shitty part is, is when you're opening up like W Wolf and you're opening up very standard. And uh, he's even done a full wall off here, it looks like. Like, what is there a... Okay, there you go. Okay, so yeah, I think he was afraid of uh, of something coming through uh, because there is no natural. But th mm. th 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 an all-in Nidus leaves you open to losing the game when you open up in a macro-heavy style, um, especially if these adepts are out of position and you, you kind of go up into the middle of the map. He's already getting another Overlord in position here. And he's obviously got this one as, as well. He'll likely put a Nidus up in this area. And then if this doesn't work, he'll throw a Nidus on the exterior um, as well. But uh, we, 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 we shall see. Now look at this. The infestation pit. Oh, no. No, is he doing mm -hmm. swarm host? Is he doing some swarm host shit? Is he doing? Is he it one of these be. guys? I hate these guys. It, it, it could be. Micro could, Jackson. Ironically not, I, I, no. I, ironically not requiring a lot of micro. Oh, uh, at no. At the end of the day. Micro but Jackson. <laughs> no. That looks like exactly what we're about to see. Uh, unfortunately for our Protoss hero, he's going to have to uh, he's gonna have to put in some work. Swarm hosts are a major pain in the ass. Uh, there he goes, getting a little bit of scouting information, sending in the faux Bob to uh, take a look around. And he's going to see that uh, there's not a hell of a lot going on oh, at the moment. Oh, man. Here comes the swarm uh, host, man. Yeah, this this build just, is just <laughs> so annoying. <laughs> well, let's see what happens here. I'm gonna I'm not gonna be a salty little hey. Terran or a Protoss player, and I'm just gonna be non-biased as possible. Listen, listen. The pylon is up there in the north end of the base. I think Wolf knows what's up. I think he knows what's coming. It don't and matter. So at least he's there. It, I know don't, it don't matter. Really matter. It's still a bitch. There it is. The first one goes down. Yep. It is being produced. The pylon spots it. Those stalkers need to be en route yesterday and aren't. Yeah. And unfortunately, he's not even warping oh. anything oh in. Oh, my God. Now Rip. the stalkers are coming, and the adept, that's too late. That is four swarm hosts and a queen. Look at that. Immediately Ain't dropping look at and that. running. That is disgusting. I'm telling you, man. The answer is they've got it as soon as they're outside of the range of the swarm. they got to die instantly. 
disgust. Why is he going right at? He's dude. Really, it did that much on the Nexus from that? Yo, one, one more volley, on it's done. One. That one more volley, and that is Dunsky. One more, and it's game over for that Nexus. Now, is he loading it up? What is he doing? Where is he? With this uh, why didn't he why get another Nexus or uh, another Nidus, uh on the exterior, right? Because why remember, these, these lo locusts back in. I mean, I mean, it's fine. It's when when that shit dies, they're fine. They're still in the Nidus network. All he needs to do is be on the outside. And remember, these fucking locusts even fly up into the base, bro. They do yeah, everything. Yeah. They do it. They do it all. Yeah, no, I'm just surprised they Here didn't we go. just send the, the swarm hosts back in in the middle of that attack to finish the job with one more volley. I well, he didn't, didn't have uh, them generated yet. I think I think what he was scared of is if he brings them in and he manages to kill off that Nidus before they get back in, all those swarm hosts yeah. are dead. So he's just playing it safe. Look, he can just do it from out here, drop some runs back in, right? He's gonna get uh, he's gonna go after that pylon. Oh, he's getting rid of the uh, the adept here in the front. Oh, he's going right after the core. Look right at that. After the core. Waste Gone. Time. Just like One that. Volley. Just like Gets that. A core. Will he get a stalker as well? He will. A core and a stalker on value. one volley. Va value. Is such insane value. Yeah, and and he hasn't wow. lost a single swarm house yet. He hasn't. He's he's still he's getting. Oh, now he's getting hydra too. Now he's gonna have some some meat and potatoes. Only four oh, swarm hosts. I'd boy. rather him just go just more and more swarm house. You don't even need the hydra. Well, just, he's got three more. He's got three more in production right now. Uh, so I guess he's doing that uh, to get a couple more, but. I mean, shit, dude. I mean, yeah. really, how many Oof. do you need if you're going to get into Hydra Oof. and you and you can keep your swarm host alive the whole time? Four might be all you fucking need. Look at that. Yep. That's crazy damage, bro. Yep. No shot. Yep. Value. No shot. Blizzard is keeping that damage. I mean, it, obviously, uh. at a high level, this is this is countered at a high percentage rate. Otherwise, this would never fly. Not even with the three people skeleton team still fucking keeping this game going. Would that oh, ever continue? Like, oh, I refuse to believe oh, it. Now oh, there's more. Bad. Oh, yeah. man. Here we fucking go. And look, right Rome back Rome in. Rome gone. The whole army now dies. Yep. And you know all what it you know what gone. it costs the Zerg? Zero, zero dollars and zero cents. <laughs> Finish off that Nexus. I mean he could just kill the Nexus right now. Oh my god, one, how many gate? Is he going to be able to get there in time? He's getting rid of it, powering down the gateways. Yeah. Holy shit. Dude, send him back in, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Send him back in. I mean, he kind of, I mean, he kind of screwed up there. He, he just killed the Nexus to stop all this production. Here we oh, go. Oh, now Hydra's the Hydra's there now. and the Void Rays oh are out. Man, what a counter, oh, bro. This is disgusting. Bro. Oh my god. Look at that. Just ran in. Gotta go. Bye bye. And he'll put another one on the outside. Yep, there it is. And then he's got this one. Wow. And he's on one base, by the way. He he will stay on one base this whole game. I guarantee it. Uh, that's probably the only thing that's gonna that if, if he loses, that's the only thing that here is that he's supply block. And now there are void rays and stuff that can that can cut off areas of the map and get there faster. But still, once again, he's, he's gone down to see if there's any more. There's not. He's getting another Nidus in his main. That main, that Nexus better go on this one. That yep. Nexus better be gone. Oh, it's going to go. It's going to go right now. Oh, my God. It's just, it's just here we go. Yep. Here we go. And right into the mineral line. Not oh, attacking oh, the Nexus for oh. some reason. Getting rid of all the probes, oh, though. Oh, Which, oh. honestly, is also pretty good. Not getting rid of oh no you oh, didn't get rid of it. Oh okay. got rid of oh the whole mineral lines just got ransacked. Oh yeah, man. There goes all the probes and the void rays. The Nexus. Yep. And the void rays all gone. <laughs> I mean this is this is painful to watch, <laughs> honest to God. I mean like, if Wolf pulls this off in some weird I don't know how. I don't know how. I really don't. But no, if he, he does he won't. There's no way. That shit's crazy, bro. Yeah, I mean I've been in these games and like I think I may have won two of them, and I mean, I had to play like an absolute god, and the game just dra dragged on for way too long, 
It's well, just, it's, it's... Basically, you must have to just get them to, if they're staying one base, you must just have to ensure that they're literally out of minerals out of that one base yes. before you can win. Yes, pretty much. And you, you, you need to have, you need to be able to, like, yeah, I don't know, man. It's, it's... It's so situational, like uh, every, and you can't make mistakes. Like that's the problem. No. Yeah. See now, well, now he's just bringing in, now Hydra. he's just bringing in the Hydra to just do a straight up fight because he's he's broken him down so much. Yeah, and now he's gone right oh, back in. Him. Micro Jackson is at least being smart about it. He's not over committing to these attacks. He True. sees once the tide of battle yep. is 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 turned in, in, in his opponent's favor, he gets the fuck out. He does not overextend himself. He seems to be getting out at the exact right time. Uh but he is gonna have to, you know, he's gotta he's gotta be considering some options here. Because yes, he is getting in and getting job done you know, the job done, but the Protoss hasn't had the main bulk of his of his resources damaged here in some time and at some point micro's gonna run out of friggin minerals so he's gotta he's gotta consider his options yeah. here i mean this is not gonna work for much longer correct well micro is sitting at 800 minerals i don't know why he's not putting down a, a base here at the gold or putting down a natural because he's floating so much like he just needs to do that he also needs to stop trying to get inside the main now that's not gonna work he just needs to be consistently attacking at the natural and with this poor choke he can really exploit that and have basically this army sort of just kind of line up and just get wrecked by locusts the other thing that i'm not a huge fan of is the the amount of hydra that he got i feel like if he would have just committed solely on the uh the locusts even though void rays will come out the void rays move very slowly and then basically you can transition after you've done your big your big meat of the damage because what he needed to do instead of killing gateways here pylons there a couple of units just go right after the nexus he had the first the first time he did it he almost killed the nexus in one volley but every volley after that he just for whatever reason left it up there and it's just like and dude just still. yeah i mean it's over <laughs> now the game is 100% done now i mean this this wow. army is ridiculous but yeah Please, but, just the Nexus has to die. Yeah, it's time. gonna go down I now. I swear to God. I mean, the whole game's over. Okay. I mean, he doesn't even have an army anymore. There it is. Yikes. Disgusting. Wow. Wow. That was a wow, Will wow, Cheese wow, win. Wow. wow. I mean, it that's, won. Yeah, it's a yeah. rare, a rare one. Yep. Where it won, and it and it won, it won in a big way. But again, like I got, I, like listen, swarm hosts are broken as fuck. Especially, I'm gonna say it. In, I don't even play this game. I don't. Anyone with two active brain cells would know that below a certain level of play, swarm hosts are definitely broken in the sense that that defeating this build takes so much more effort. Yep. Than using the build. That's the that's the the measuring stick, right? In the lower leagues, broken literally is something that's reserved for like the top 0.01 percent. Where yep. you're worried about broken shit. This is just, it's too easy for too high of an output, clearly. And the one way to do it without completely eviscerating the value of a swarm host is to ensure that when the swarm host is out of a certain range from the swarms, they die immediately. Agreed. Problem, problem solved. Then this build goes away. Yep. Or at least it goes away in the sense that it's so easily... It's manageable. You know, you know what I mean? Like, then you can spammable. handle it. Yes. Yes. Yeah. But... You're still gonna... You're still gonna struggle... Yeah. ...in that opening. Yeah. But yeah. you can... You can manage it... Where... Right now? Bruh. Bruh is That's right. Tough. Bruh is right. I mean, at the very... At, it's either that or when you're going back into the Nidus, there's like a delay. You know what I mean? Like, you gotta wait... Yeah you know three a seconds cool for each like unit to be able to get in you know what i mean like i don't know yeah. how you do it but i think your thing is the best if they're not in a certain yeah. range they just the locusts just die they need their they need their uh their host but yeah. it is what it is hey we can bitch about it until we're blue in the face it ain't gonna fucking it ain't <laughs> it ain't gonna change it was a, it was well executed by micro jackson um yes. you know it is what it is it's a it's a it's a very vi uh, viable build so if you guys want to do this shit on the ladder, it will work a lot, especially as you start to tighten it up and you start to get much better at. Uh, and I mean, Michael Jackson didn't even do it the best. He, he you know, he, he made some mistakes, but I mean, that even goes to show um, is that strong. strong. But 
But anyway, guys, we'll call it right there. If Please send in some replays to lifesaglitchtv at gmail.com. Don't forget to go check out our sponsor, NordVPN. Link will be in the description below. And we will see you all on the next one. Peace! Peace. Hey, I do that. <laughs>